And let's not forget the work we do for Homeland Security. The mechanized infantry is the largest standing army the world has ever seen. And seeing as the Tin Man Corporation to treat my has successfully eradicated Pokemon. A data stream found. Appendix. Luddites. Uploading. Luddites was the name given to a group of machine breakers in 1800 England. To gain a greater insight into this movement, it is perhaps best to listen to an enactment of a typical Luddite rally. Half for one has had enough. These factory owners and their newfangled mills care nothing for us. They're only looking for one thing. Profit. Whilst we have to deal with falling wages, job loss and the threats of being put in workhouse. I demand we get a decent wage for doing a decent job. I demand the right to be able to clothe and feed our families. What are we going to do, John? Let's burn them buggers down. Who's with me? However, the tribes of savages that dwell in the wastelands of Middle England and are now descending upon the powerless and stranded Royal Stevenson Express could more accurately be described as neo-anarcho-primitivists. They share relatively little in common with the Luddites of old and are quite, quite mad. Could this day get any worse? I've dealt with Luddites before. They've never struck me as being particularly violent. You've dealt with them before? Of course you have. You all go on dirt-sieving expeditions, I suppose. I trade with them. Artifacts and stuff. They're like old books, you know. Books? They really are savages. I heard they eat people. Nonsense. But why are they attacking? I mean, this might not be very welcoming news, but I think we might be trespassing in their territory or something. We're normally going too fast for them to catch us. Great. Are we in any danger of them actually breaking the inn? Considering the pound we're taking, yes. Double great. And we have no power? Not a sliver. But you have power, right? I mean, power cells and stuff. You still have juice. Could we not rig something together to give us some kind of boost? We need, like, a lot of power cells. But it might just work. Splendid. So why don't you, my crusty colleague, go and see what you can gather whilst I stay here and be safe. Aye, it's probably best I go. I got better people skills anyways. Is there any chance you can at least power up the lights for me? Consider it done. What? A steel serpent may show signs of life, but it still does not move. Resume the attack. We shall pierce its hide yet. Yeah! Oh, hello. What's going on? Oh, it's a long story. We're trying to get the train working, but... Uh... Who are those people outside? Oh, again, it's a long story. If you would just let... I'm scared. Okay. Oh, you appear to have wet yourself. The toilet wouldn't let me in, and I didn't know how my trousers worked. Right. Listen, uh, if you would all just listen to me. We're trying to get the train working, but I need your help. I need electronic devices, anything with a power cell. We're going to try and get... I have got music player. Oh, oh, fantastic. That's what I need. Music players, laptops. I've got 10,000 songs. Oh, OK, great. Laptops, phones, anything. Uh, if you could just form an orderly queue and I'll, I'll collect them up. Why didn't you go with her? You know, there is something I just don't understand. Why are you here? I'm not sure. I'm understanding your question. I'm not talking philosophy. Just, why are you here, now? So the big plan was for you all to shut off at once. One big show of robot solidarity. But you just happen to be here, alive. Like I said, the train was running late. Trying as I did, I just couldn't make the destination on time. Don't forget, I know what you devices can do. At any time, you could have transferred your personality to another unit anywhere on the globe. Yet you chose to be here. You chose to stay alive. I know what you are. You do? You're a coward. I like cowards. I understand the cowards. When the rest of the robots put up a united front and terminated themselves, you hid away like a frightened little child. Sweet Sherway, what have I done? Took one step closer to being human. And now you will do as I say. You will follow my every little instruction. Not because I have your access codes, but for the fear that I will expose your dirty little secret. When we bring power back to the world, when everything is restored, I shall tell the world what you've done, and they won't call you a robot anymore. They shall call you Monster. 
unless you help me every step of the way. Is that understood? Yes. Lesson two on being human. Getting blackmailed sucks. Ah, my hippie friend is returning. Oh, is this enough? It does certainly give us evidence, but I'm not sure how long. Well, it looks like it's up to me to try and lighten the load. Don't go anywhere. What will you do? You and your Monty tool look after the engineering. I'll take care of the details. It's what I do.